Please stand for the morning prayers. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Our Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. The mission of Immaculate Conception Catholic School is to offer all students from early childhood to adolescence a quality Roman Catholic education by meeting the specific needs of the student in their spiritual, academic, cultural, physical, and social development. This will ensure a Christ-centered life and awareness of God in an ever-changing world. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the national anthem. Watching WICS Celtic News from the hallways to the classrooms, bringing you the latest in school news and information. Your Celtic News starts now. Good morning, Celtics. Today is Thursday, November 3rd, 2016. Welcome to your Celtic News. I'm Max. And I'm Emily, and here's your daily news. Good morning, teachers and students, and thank you for joining us in this month's segment of Getting Caught in Jesus' Net. We'd like to congratulate all of last month's winners for the Dignity Award. We are very proud of all of our students, as well as our teacher, Mrs. Callow, who was the recipient for the Dignity Award. This month of November, we celebrate gratefulness, or gratitude. Gratitude. We have so many things to be thankful for, for our friends, our family, our school, and our teachers. We are here this month to look out for all of those who express and demonstrate gratitude. So boys and girls, we'll be watching out this month of November to see which student and staff member best demonstrates the character trait of gratitude. Thank you for joining us. coding club. 
Kids in 7th and 8th grade use a high school program to code. They even learn how to write in creative. We talked to Javier Busto, the founder of the coding club, and some of its members. What inspired me to get into coding was that my whole life I've always really been into, you know, computers, video games, and all that stuff. I've never thought that I wanted to, you know, maybe make one or get involved in programming and coding. But this year, in my senior year, I started taking a computer science class that taught me a lot about coding. It's, it's a very interesting subject, you know, there's a, it doesn't seem like it, but there's a lot of art to it. You really need to, you can't just look at it as black and white. There's very, there's different ways that you can make something happen. There's a million different ways you can make one thing happen. And that's what I really like about it. I really think when you're writing a code to do something specific, whatever you want, it's really your own art piece. It's something that you're making yourself creative. What made me want to bring a coding club to Immaculate was that I think programming and code is something that we're going to need in the future in our everyday lives. You know, uh, technology is already becoming such a big part of society and I just think that as uh, people we all need to know at least the basics of what we're doing when we're working with the technology that we're given. I joined Coding Club because uh, computers have always appealed to me since I was a little kid and I like typing up stuff and everything to do with computers. I think coding is important because if you're ever playing a video game it can teach you what you're doing or if you're on a website it, you can help you can look at the the console for the website and you find out what's on the website and you can see everything. Matthew Del Cristo reporting for WICS Celtic News. For more school news and information, follow us on Twitter at ICS Miami. And on Instagram at ICS Celtics. Have, Have a, a great, great day, Celtics. Celtics.